And now your 13 News Now weather forecast, certified most accurate in Hampton Roads. Well, a lot of sunshine today, but a chilly day. Temperatures only around 40 degrees. That's as warm as we've been today. That's our current temperature. But with those southerly winds, we're looking at a big warm up coming up for the day tomorrow. Radar sweeping clear. Again, you'd expect that with the mainly clear skies that we've seen today, though we had some of those high thin clouds that have been filtering out or dimming the sunshine just a little bit and notice off towards the north and west. We have a couple areas of these bowed clouds. These are the cold fronts that we talk about quite often and we've got a series of fronts, two of them actually one that is located right through here and then there's a second one that is right behind it. So these two fronts will slide through here late Thursday night into Friday morning, giving us a chance at some showers and maybe a little bit of wintry mix as we start the day on Friday. We'll time things out here with Futurecast, mainly clear skies through the evening, just a few of those high thin clouds. And as we go through the overnight, temperatures will actually start to rise. Notice by 11 o'clock, temperatures around 33, 35, 36. But with those southerly winds, they'll actually come up maybe a degree or two by 6 o'clock into the morning. And with those strong southerly winds, the sunshine coming up, those temperatures will go even higher than they were today by noon already into the mid 50s and up near 60 into the afternoon. We'll start to see some clouds though on the increase by late in the day as that first cold front arrives and pushes closer to Richmond. Notice by 11 o'clock chances for some showers from Tappahannock down towards Richmond after midnight likely for most of our area and into Friday morning as that front slides through. Good chance at some wet weather around as we start that morning commute at 6 a.m. But with those winds switching around towards the north, cold air rushing in behind the rain just on the back edge, we could see some of that rain start to mix with or change over to a little bit of snow. But again, like the last snow that we had coming on the heels of a warm day and quite a bit of rain, likely not causing any problems on any roadways, maybe just a little quick dusting on the tops of cars or some grassy surfaces or decks or things like that. But even then, that'll move out pretty quickly and it'll be a chilly day by Friday afternoon. Falling temperatures readings only in the upper 30s and that'll lead to a cold day on Saturday as well. Beautiful sunrise earlier this morning looking over the Elizabeth River and parts of Norfolk and Portsmouth. Every once in a while again we saw some of those high thin clouds streaming in and temperatures have been slow to warm up, but we're finally up to 40 degrees, which is our current air temperature of winds out of the south at 11 miles per hour. 38 degrees in Chesapeake, a lot of 40s on the map from Wakefield down towards Ahoski and Edenton. A little bit cooler on the eastern shore, those southerly winds blowing across the bay and coming in off the ocean means that temperatures are just a little bit cooler up along the uh, Delmarva. For tonight, though, partly cloudy, breezy, cold, 32 for an overnight low and 61 tomorrow, partly to mostly sunny skies. Probably more sunshine in the morning, partly to mostly cloudy by late in the day and then cloudy overnight with some showers possible after midnight 42 and that chance of some rain or some mixed precipitation as we start the day on Friday. High temperature only around 42 degrees and likely falling a bit during the later afternoon hours. Saturday high of only 39 with a lot of sunshine. Then we're back into the 50s on Sunday. Another front moves in, giving us some more showers, and that could possibly mix with a little bit of rain or, or some snow. So we start the day on Monday, falling temperatures once again, 46 on Tuesday, 53 on Wednesday. Okay.